Good morning. Hello, hello. <clears throat> morning, morning, guys. It is Sunday. It is Sunday, 9 o'clock, week 10. So let's get ready. We're going to be doing today some full body stretching. Let me just close the door from the house. Okay. Cool. So we're going to really dedicate the whole day to just stretching the body, making it sort of more flexible, um, giving it energy back from the whole week. Um, so we get ready to start the next week, which is as of tomorrow, and it's going to be week 11. I, I don't think I'm going to continue counting anymore, which is going to keep on doing this. Um, so yeah, that's, uh, that's how we're going to roll today. We're going to do the usual stuff. So we're going to do a gentle waking up of the body. We're going to go into the yoga, and then we're going to do some more kind of uh, fitness yoga type of stretching. Um, just to sort of relax uh, and make sure we are ready for the next week. So grab your mat if you have a mat. If you don't have a mat, make sure you are in a sort of a little place surface where you have a bit of a space to move. This is pretty good. Let me see. We can come a little bit closer. Yes, perfect. Okay. Grab your water. Get into your Zen mood. It's a bit of a chilly morning in Amsterdam. It's raining also a bit. I have my tea. I really don't know what I'll do. Uh, I would do without this. Uh, this tea. It's it's. Oh, it's my. It's my elixir in the morning. Honestly. Okay. Okay. So let's start with some stretching. Gentle waking up of the body. Um, make sure you are sort of really here and now. Breathe. Um, focus on the breathing <clears throat> that's gonna help you really sort of relax and um, kind of concentrate it's also a way of meditating so it is not only beneficial for the body but it's also beneficial for the mind <sighs> nose in <sighs> mouth out nose in <sighs> Mouth out. Okay, get your hands up. <clears throat> Stretch on one side. Stretch on the other side. Breathe. Make sure you breathe all the time. Bring your hands front and simply stretch from your shoulder blades. Bring your hands behind. Grab your hands. Lift them up. And look up. If you cannot hold your hands, that's okay. Just make sure that your hands are really stretched to your maximum so you can open up the chest. I'm going to have to turn a little bit because my mat is getting pretty... wet here <laughs> okay okay <clears throat> get your hands behind your head pull gently down we're gently waking up the body so no unusual no strange movements one side the palm to the ear, the other side, palm to the ear. Okay. Get your hands up. 
really like shoulder height nice up one hand is up the other one goes down look towards the palm that is down rotate palms and turn your neck as well make sure your hands are nice and up wide in line really good for the neck muscles this one especially if you have slept or not like myself yesterday then really this is good feels really really good okay we're gonna go ahead and do um neck rotations so chin to the chest to the side up to the other side down full circle breathe other side try to keep everything else fixed just your neck if you feel dizzy close your eyes and stand still okay let's uh, move to the shoulders so we're gonna bring the shoulders up your hands are relaxed shoulders up and from here do full rotations and front Hey, nice. We're gonna swing with the arms, just a little bit extra for our shoulders. Maximum up, maximum back, really stretch. Use the momentum. You can even do some no swimmers if you want. The trick here is that you make sure you're fixed so not to move, but really just your hands a little bit front or back a little bit front nice okay from the shoulders we go to the waist and the spine so we're gonna massage our waist midsection and the spine feet a little bit wide Make sure your hips are fixed. We're gonna turn from the waist and with our hands, we're gonna hug ourselves and look back. So just turn, hug, look back. Try to really sort of other side, your waist, turn, look back. Really with your neck, try to go as far as you can with your eyesight. Make sure that your hips don't move, just your waist. And look back one more time, the other side. We're massaging the waist and the hips, the spine. Okay. From there, we're gonna move on to, sorry, my eyes are leaking. <laughs> As per usual, nice mornings in my house with the boys. <laughs> uh, okay, we're gonna move on to our hips. Get your hands on your waist. Feet are a little bit wide. And from here, really go to the maximum stretch to the side, back to the other side, front. So do full circles, really feel that stretch. You can do it a little bit faster as long as you make sure you really stretch to your max. And the other side. Okay, nice. We come to the knees. Bend the knees a little bit. 
and from here hold them and do a nice circle. Three. Okay, and the other side. Nice. Okay, massaging the knees. Uh, find your balance point. So what we are gonna do is then lift one leg up, or you can hold yourself onto something. We're gonna rotate the ankles. And the other side. Same thing with the other leg. Find your balance point, lift up. And the other side. Okay. That was the signal that mommy is hearing what they are doing. And I should... <laughs> okay. Hands up. We're gonna do some rotations with the hands. Really use that momentum with the fingers. Full rotations of your wrists. Really, really good if you're behind the computer, a laptop. Okay. Other side. Use that momentum with your fingers. Really stretch with the fingers as well. Full, nice. Excellent. If you do it properly, you're really going to feel it in the side of your arms, which is the point where we want to really make sure that it's everything is loose. Cool. Part one is done. We're going to move on to part two. I hope it's not going to rain, which is the yoga. Nice. And I need it, especially after yesterday's boot camp. My God. Okay. Taking my shoes off, as you know, guys. So, what you can do is either grab your mat, yoga mat, or if you don't have a yoga mat, just make sure you're on a non slippery surface and you have a little nice space to move, especially sort of towards the back. Okay. If you're on your yoga mat, come in front of the yoga mat and get your feet nicely parallel. Stay strong. Breathe a few times. Breathe in nose. Breathe out mouth. In nose. Out mouth. One more time. <clears throat> Bring your hands in front, breathe in, lift up, big bend. Breathe out, from bend. Touch the ground or go as far as you guys feel comfortable. This first stretch is always the most challenging. Okay. We go down, bend the knees, hands next to your feet. Do a nice jump with your leg. Once you're to your max, get the knee down. Come up, feel that stretch. Feel that you're nicely stretched once you're at your maximum stretch. Hold the ground and look up, breathe. Okay, I'm going to slide the other leg back, legs are together, feet, feet are parallel, once you're ready, come in one line, shoulders on top of your hands, breathe, 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 we go down, hands next to your body, control that Come to the ground, kiss the ground. Hands, your palms are under your shoulders. Hands next to your body. Feet and heels together. Breathe in. Lift up. Look up. Breathe. 
hand grenades to your body a little bit under an angle so they're not completely straight but really an angle because the hips should be on the ground heels together turn just your waist and look at your feet one side turn look at your feet the other side come central bend the feet and lift up come into the nice strong position hands are straight the legs are straight their feet are parallel back is also straight the neck is loose <clears throat> push gently with your hands so you can feel the stretch in your feet in your legs behind your legs okay we're gonna gently swing and bring the foot front okay come into your maximum stretch once you're done knee on the ground get up feel that stretch pull the ground look up excellent Let's bring the other leg front, do a little jump, <coughs> feet are parallel, breathe out, come down, stretch <coughs> to your maximum. If you can touch the ground, touch the ground, if not, it's okay. Breathe a few times, stay like that or do the extra with me. I'm gonna Put the hands behind my legs, breathe out, and I'm pulling myself towards my knees. My neck is loose. We go up, bend the knees, back straight. Hand, ears between your hands, back up, button hips up, breathe in, back bend. Out, hands in front, <coughs> hands down. Let's breathe. We're gonna do the same cycle with the other side. Okay, bring hands front, breathe in, lift up, big bend. Breathe out, come gently down, bend, come to your maximum. Breathe, excellent. We go down, bend the knees, hands next to your feet, bring the other leg back. Nice stretch. Once you're to the maximum, get the knee down, stretch, get up, feel that stretch nicely across your whole line. Once you're ready, on the ground, look up, breathe. Excellent. We bring the other foot back, nicely slide, hands parallel, feet parallel. Once you're ready, come in one line, strong. Shoulders on top of your hands. Breathe. Breathe. One more time. Breathe. We go down. Control. Come down. Kiss the ground. Your palms are under your shoulders. Hands are next to your body. Feet are and heels are together. Breathe in. Lift up. Look up, hands next to your body, hips on the ground, feet and heels 
together. Turn on one side, look at your feet, everything else stays the same. Other side, look at your feet, excellent, come central, bend the feet and lift. Find the balance point. Hands are parallel, feet are parallel. Back is straight, neck is loose. Push with your hands a little bit. Feel it behind your legs. Three, excellent. We're gonna swing and bring the foot front. Okay, get a nice line. Really strong maximum stretch, then get the knee down. Get up, feel that nicely. Come down on your stretch. As you're ready, hold the ground. Look up. Breathe. Breathe. Excellent. Nice little jump. Bring the foot front. Breathe out. Come down. Breathe. Either stay like this or do the maximum with me. With a little bit extra behind, hands behind your legs. The legs are straight as far as you can. Breathe out and pull your body towards your knees. Okay. We go up, bend the knees. Big straight. Ears between your hands, back up, hips and butt up, breathe in, back bend, breathe out, hands down, breathe a few times. Nose in, mouth out, last time. Mouth out. Okay, nice. Thank you very much. I'm leaking all the way through, okay. I'm going to be putting my shoes on. What we're going to do is continue with some more stretching. I can do it also without the shoes, but it's a little bit chilly. We're going to do some more extra stretches for the upper body, midsection, the lower body. Stretch the legs, stretch the hips. Our back. Okay. If you feel like staying and doing this extra stretch, I really encourage you to do so, especially for you guys that are doing the workouts with me in the morning. Okay. We're gonna do it simple. Okay. Come down on your mat or on the floor. Sit. Close your mind. Okay. Get your feet together. Parallel. Bring one foot to the knee. It's my right foot. I'm going to support myself with my right hand behind and with my left hand I'm going to sort of hug my knee and pull towards me and look back. Breathe. 
We're gonna do the exact same thing with the other side. So my left leg next to my knee, my left hand behind, with my right hand I'm sort of hugging my knee and pulling it towards my body and then turning back and stretch. Breathe. Nice. Really good for the hips as well as the back and the spine. Okay, let's go up. These are all variations of fitness and yoga moves, so it's nothing um, kind of um, it's unusual or anything. We're gonna do a lunge. So come strong with one of your legs. All right, okay. I have my right leg front, left hand, so opposite hand goes on the ground, and with my other hand, I'm gonna look up and stretch. Breathe, breathe, breathe. Okay, come down. We're gonna do the exact same thing with the other leg, so do your maximum. Stretch, find a nice balanced position. Okay, here we go. Bend the knee, right knee, left leg, right knee, left hand on the ground. Right hand goes up and stretch. Breathe, breathe. Okay. We can do this either sitting on the knees or standing. Either ways, it's good. Bring your hands up. Bend the elbow. Grab the elbow. Stretch. Make sure you tip on the back of your, in the middle of your back. Really stretch. Breathe. Okay, lift the hands up again, other elbow, bend, pull, tip your back, in the middle of your back, breathe, breathe, nice, okay, we're gonna go on the ground, Lay on the ground, knees are bent, bring one knee over the other, lift the leg and grab it under, get back on your back, pull the leg towards you, breathe, this is a really nice hip stretch, breathe, excellent, bring the leg down, we do the exact same thing other side, bend, bring the knee over, lift the leg, come and grab it under, come back on the ground and pull the leg towards you, oh, this is good. Breathe. Okay. We're gonna go up. Let me see what's next. So, okay. We're gonna do another stretch for your hips. From feet front, bring one foot back. Make sure that it's on 90 degree angle. So it's really 90 degree angle. Do the exact same thing with the front foot. So your back foot is on 90 degree. Your front leg is on 90 degree. And then get yourself 
up so push on this side so I'm pushing from here towards the inside you're gonna feel that really nicely on your hip if you want to do the extra get the leg towards you and then just slowly bend walk with your hands lie on your knee lie down on your knee and stretch this is for you guys that have really sort of elastic hips uh, if you cannot do this it's okay don't do it just keep on standing in the previous position okay we go up we're gonna do the exact same thing with the other leg so bend the knee back knee the back leg under 90 degrees angle bring your front leg under 90 degrees angle and then just gently get yourself straight push a little bit so you can feel that stretch in the hip okay. we're the ones that want to do the extra bring the foot towards you and then with your hands walk and lie down on your knee breathe breathe okay we go back up we're gonna do another very interesting one which is the frog position so come on all four From here, try to open up your knees to your maximum, get them wide. Once you're at your maximum, get your feet really on the ground, so you really look like a frog. And then gently push back, so not front, push back, you're going to open up the hips. And this is a frog position. Breathe. You're really going to feel it in your groins. <sighs> Breathe. Okay. Come slowly into a normal position. From here, we're going to do another animal or insect or whatever you want to call it, which is the butterfly. Get your feet. together as close as possible to your body when you're at your max grab your toes grab your leg and hold get your back straight breathe and let gravity do its work if you want to do the extra you can just with your elbows push let just gravity do the other part you just breathe okay this is a butterfly let's see what i have uh, okay Get nicely up, straight on the knees, and from here, get one leg to the side, parallel to the body. Hold for balance with your hand, lift the other hand up, and stretch. When you're at your max, look up, breathe. Breathe. Okay, come down. Other side, same thing. Knee. From here, stretch. Once you're at your in one line, hold for balance with your hand. Lift the other hand up. Stretch. Once you're at your maximum, look up. <sighs> 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 
breathe. Okay, come down. Uh, I'll do a variation of this one simply because I don't have enough space. So what we're gonna do is get, it's a T stretch. So we lie on the ground, do a T form. But since I don't have enough space to rotate, I'm just gonna do a variation of it. So get on your uh, knees, come down to the ground, so stretch, walk with your hands, come to the maximum. Once you're at your maximum, get your head on the ground. And then from here, open up your hand so you really form like a T letter. Your head is on the ground. I'm going to start with my left hand. I'm going to bring my left hand under my shoulder. And from here, I'm going to rotate my leg, rotate my head, and stretch my right shoulder. Breathe. Breathe. Okay, come central. Back in a T position. My right hand under my right shoulder. I'm gonna rotate my head, lie on the ground and lift myself up gently so I can feel the stretch on the other shoulder. Breathe. Okay. Come central. Nicely, gently up. Okay. This is also a very nice stretch. Come on the ground. Both legs straight. From here, bend one knee, grab your knee, and pull it towards your your body. The other leg is straight. Breathe. 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 Get the leg down, get the other one up. Grab your knee, pull it towards your body. The other one is straight. Breathe. 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 Okay. Get the knee down. We're going to lift both legs up. Knee to the chest. Hug your knees. Come to the ground. Breathe. 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 Okay. Let me see what we have else for today. But I think in general we are just done. Okay. I'm gonna do one last one, which is the puppy pose. So all four. Get your legs a little bit, your knees a little bit apart. You're in 90 degree angle with your uh, legs and the hips, so that stays like that, and you just walk with your hand. It's like when you see a puppy stretching. When you come to your maximum, get down. Back is straight. Hands are straight. Okay. Nice. Roll the back with your hands. Get up. Last but not least, okay. Sit nicely on your uh, legs if you can. We're gonna we're stretching the quads. Get your back straight up, and if you feel like it, bend a little bit back. If you feel like you need to support, support. But if you can stay like this, that's good. Excellent. Come back up, gently up on your feet, shake it off, nice, 
hips a little bit. Excellent, guys. That's it for today. Sunday stretch feels good. I have to admit, feels really, really good. After a whole week of just jumping around, this feels really good. Uh, thank you, thank you all. Thank you very, very much. Thank you for the support. I hope you guys are doing this with, uh, together with me. Uh, I hope you're enjoying it as much as I do. Uh, morning stretch. I'm now going to hit and do my breakfast, which I love, 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 love. Uh, my power smoothie. Um, enjoy the Sunday. Have a lot of fun. Um, have a nice end of the week for the ones that are celebrating uh, Ramadan. Um, congratulations. Uh, much health, much love, uh, much prosperity. I hope it brings you a lot of uh, joy and a lot of happiness to you and your uh, friends, family. Um, it is Sunday. It's going to be a rest day. And I see you guys again tomorrow, 9 a.m. Thank you. Thank you very much. And uh, see you tomorrow. Bye.